Don't fret because we've got more to come here on Daybreak, not just today, but the, throughout the rest of the Super Bowl run down here in Indianapolis. We talked about the excitement for the big game. It is, to use a racing word, truly revving up downtown. We're getting our first look at the supercars as the sun comes up over downtown Indianapolis. You'll really see the racing shine that they have added to this. Volunteers with Indy Racing Experience that all morning unloading. Yes, all morning early today, unloading the 33 supercars. They all have different paint schemes from the teams or the league. The work started around midnight on Monument Circle, wrapped up just hours ago. Now, those are the outgoing cars, if you will, the Galars that have uh, raced around the 500 track of the Speedway and all the rest of the Indy Racing League uh, series for some time. But what's interesting about, as we look live, on the Giants car and the Patriots car, you'll see strange things on an Indy car, wheel fairings and a little lower carriage, maybe even a turbocharger if they put the engines in there, I don't know, but let's talk more about it with the Kinsey Collins who knows all about this from Delara, the company that got this partnership not just with the uh, racing community but also here in Indianapolis as well. And now with the Super Bowl and the NFL, how did you guys link up? Because this is truly a first, right? It is. Uh, the Indianapolis Super Bowl, actually, the committee approached any racing experience and just tried to see if this is even a possibility. And so from there, we, we never say no to anything. So we just uh, had to round up all the cars from our company and from private owners and from teams. And so we went from there. The timing works really well, actually, because these teams, maybe as museum pieces, have a use for them. But other than that, these cars aren't largely going to race again. No, they're all mainly show cars. Only a few of them have actually run in the past. Um, a couple of them were run last year, one by Simona. about the partnership with the NFL. Famously, you know, they'll very tightly control things. You couldn't just roll one down here. How did that partnership happen? The NFL came to you? The uh, Indianapolis Super Bowl Committee came to us. Okay. So this is the first time that the NFL has ever branded another sport. So it's a huge deal for IndyCar to have any type of other logo on it from the NFL. The um, new car, it does look enough different that people go, what is that? So what do you want people to really look at as they see that Giants car and see that Patriots?